Yes, you everyone, welcome to another book review. And on this channel series, I review books in five minutes or less. And today we have got 12 Rules for Life by the legend Jordan Peterson. If you don't know who Jordan Peterson is, where have you been? I mean, come on, the guy's just been everywhere, man. Um, so Jordan Peterson is a university professor that teaches psychology at the University of Toronto. He's also well known for his incredible smart intellect and his interview on Channel 4 that's ranked over 20 million views. That interview was just insane. I uh, watched it the other day and it was, I was just like, I was baffled how smart this guy is. He was basically sharing his views on cultural and political issues. He's also well known for his long lectures that have ranked over millions of views on YouTube as well. So I first came across Jordan by watching one of his YouTube videos um, about motivation and how to find a purpose in life. And after watching that, I realized how unintelligent I was. Um, I looked at him, I was just watching him, the way he's speaking, I, massive, I massively admired the way he communicated. And I was just like, as soon as he opened his mouth, I was like, you're just different gravy, mate. You're like, you just fucking unbelievable. Guys, unbelievable communicator. To give a quick summarize on the book, um, the book is basically about 12 rules for life that you can implement on your own life. Um, so these are Jordan's antidotes for chaos that can help you improve your life for the better. Um, so it's basically a self-help book. So he interprets these rules through anecdotes that include psychology, religion, and ethical principles. But to be honest, most of them are Christian anecdotes and references throughout the whole book. So as soon as I dived into the book, I noticed it was, it was gonna be one of them books where I had to double read on what I've just read so I could fully understand the meaning of that text or passage. I think especially with the anecdotes as well, I had to reread them over and over again to fully understand what he meant or I tried to picture what was happening in my, in my head whilst I was reading or listening to the book on Audible. So in that sense as well, it wasn't a quick read. I mean, the book's got about 300 pages anyway and the way he expresses his values in his chapter, there was no surprise that it took me a couple of weeks to finish off this book. So I really did enjoy the book at the start. I really loved the first three chapters, but after that I started to lose more and more interest um, simply because there was a lot of religious references and anecdotes and I'm not a religious person, so I didn't really resonate with them or connect with them in, in, in that sense. I enjoyed more of the passages that involved more of the psychology side um, because I like finding out why um, we do things and the history behind it and things like that. And I associated his job title with I guess the theme of this book. Like for example, rule one is stand tall with your shoulders back. So it basically states that adjusting your posture can influence the way people treat you, um, resulting in you being a happier, healthier person. So it states that having an open posture perceives people to look at you as an individual that is confident and ready for life. Having a weaker posture that is slumped and rounded off can make you seem weak or vulnerable, showing you have lower social dominance. So that was one of the reasons why I really did like the book, but towards the end, I just got it quite boring and I didn't really enjoy it that much than I thought I would. But overall, I think it's a very solid book, uh, very beautiful, articulated, and he explains his rules in huge, huge detail. Obviously, that's the way Jordan Peterson is, and I didn't really expect it to be um, any different, really. But it is a great book. Like, I, It's a good book to get lost in. Um, if you want a quick read, uh, this definitely isn't the book for you. Um, it's more of a sit down and think deeply um, about what rules you want to implement on your life and how it can benefit you in any kind of way. Yeah, personally, I would rate this book a three out of five. Like I said, it's a thick and dense book. Um, dense in meaning, obviously, the pages and just the thought processes over all of the rules um, he includes in this book. If you want a short read, this is probably not the book for you. I would suggest something else. But overall, it is a solid three out of five. So that is the review finished. Stop the clock. I don't know how I did. Let's see how I did. Um, but thank you for watching, guys. Um, I'll put a link to this book in the description below if you want to purchase it. Um, so yeah, subscribe to my channel for more book reviews. And I'll see you in the next video.